All right, Christina, tell us what you got. All right, so my pick is going to be Keyboard Maestro 11, which came out, uh, I think, like last week. And uh, this is just like this is an app that we've talked about before. Um, I love it. I um, really, really um, like it's one of these apps that I don't use as much as I, I could, but that every time I jump into it just a little bit, I realize how much I like it. And there are a lot of different automation apps out there. Uh, you know, there, there's a better touch tool, and, and obviously you can do some similar things with things like Text Expander, but. I really love the interface and the stability of um, Keyboard Maestro. And so I oftentimes use all three of those for different things. But um, if you're somebody who you know wants to have a really good way of automating stuff or, or doing very specific things with keystrokes, I love, love, love Keyboard Maestro. And, and the new um, version includes a CLI, which is very exciting. So now you can just run Keyboard Maestro um, in your command line to run um, some of your automations, which I think is really cool. And, uh, so, um, congrats to them for, you know, uh, continuing to put out a really, really good app. And, and this was one of those things I got the email about my upgrade and I was like, that is absolutely, I was like, this is the easiest, like $18 yep, or whatever that I could buy. spend. Yeah, yep. totally. So keyword my yeah. is my pick. 